good team exclusive and welcome back to some more fifa 21 content today we are back with a brand new episode of the road to glory now big things as always last episode we packed um Lionel messi 250,000 coins tradable massive stuff highest rated gold player i think we've ever actually packed uh, just normal card um Obviously, previously before that, we packed 91 foot birthday Sane from team one. And team two, we now packed foot birthday Tamori. I, I I can't believe it. It's insane. I really wish I had the recording of me actually packing this player. Obviously, there he is in my team. Um, first donor, untradeable, all that kind of stuff. Five star skills, four star weak foot. You do love to see it. Um, but yeah, I, I, I don't know. I did try and record it. It's just that as I've got two screens... It decided to record the other screen, so not helpful. But either way, um, yeah, he came from that mega pack you get from just completing the four daily objectives and then, you know, uh, or SPCs and then you complete the objective, get the mega pack. Hey, it was one of those. It was really weird because before I opened it, I was kind of like, oh, you know, I feel like I'm actually going to get something good. And then and then we did. So crazy, crazy. But yeah, there we go. We packed Tamori like uh, unreal unreal of course we have our div rivals rewards i don't think i played any division rivals we got two mega packs though i'm just saying got tamori out of a mega pack so you know just saying but let's see what we get anyway if uh if we get something good it's a uh, thumbs up all round if not then i really don't care it doesn't make much difference i don't even get boards that's a bit it's a bit sad not gonna lie it's a bit sad. James Rodriguez. Get some rares and non-rares for if they ever do decide to ever release. Um, some player picks again, which I have no idea if they're going to or not. I, God knows. Absolutely no idea what's going on. Alright, well. <laughs> Let's open our second one if we can. It. I don't know what's going on with the game today. Things are just incredibly slow. Not that it's not like that always, but come on, what we're we saying. Not even boards. Okay, well we got cucked by a Libertadores, so it could be, could be a boards. It's not. I mean, there's not really a whole lot really going on in FIFA at the moment. So um, I say that pretty much every single time, besides when they do release, you know, actual content. But it's these times that I really wish they would just release some milestones or have consistent milestones throughout the year because you know it would make the game so much more enjoyable if there was actually stuff to earn just by playing the game like you played with i don't know five super league players and you can earn like a you know some story like or squad foundation super league player that'd be really cool i again i've said this before and i don't know why they don't do it really don't but either way if you're new to this series this is the team i know you'd think i've spent a shit ton of money on fifa and You'd be absolutely correct. But besides <laughs> besides that, I, I mean, ironically, um, he's an objective. Bairdin's objective. Balak's uh, an SBC, obviously. Uh, we packed him. He's an SBC. Kaka's an SBC. Um, we packed Messi out of a free pack and Tomori out of a free pack. So I'm just saying, you know, it's not all money spent, but he is uh, two and a half million coins and he is like 600k. So... You know, technically, the amount of foot birthdays we could have got and we managed to pick up Tamori is insane because he works so perfectly. Of course, Bayardine is now on eight, which is which is fine. It's not going to make any difference to him at all being on 10 or eight. I mean, he's still going to get maximum pace. Defending still is, is still going to be tragic as always. I mean, it's, it really doesn't matter. So, um, yeah, I'm very happy with that. I'm very happy we get an insanely solid defender. Uh, unfortunately, that does kick you know, Carlito Pollo out of the team, uh, which is a bit of a shame. But, you know, I'm not going to say no to that uh, 87 pace. And you'll notice I put an anchor on him just because uh, he gets even more pace. <laughs> not that he needs it. Um, but yeah, just like, uh, it's just crazy. I mean, he's got good passing. His dribbling is good for a defender. Now, what more do you want? That is literally the, the perfect defender. Four-star weak foot as well. Um, Five-star skills. Not that you'll need it, but um, yeah, crazy. And he, he strong links to Sol Campbell, or Sol Campbell strong links to him. Who knows which way, which way it works, but um, either way, I'm not going to complain. But for this special episode of The Road to Glory, to celebrate our, our pack-pulling nature of uh, Tomori, we're going to play him 
up front and see what he does up uh, up top as striker. Today, of course, that does mean we are going to put back in Carlito Poyo to get the 100 chemistry. And uh, yeah, going to see how, how good or bad this is going to be. It's all in the name of fun. So, uh, you know, and I don't care about rewards. So if I lose all, th all three of these games, who cares, right? Who cares? I don't even play all 30 games anyway, so it, it really doesn't make a scrap of difference. But be interesting to see how good he does. He's got supposedly 90 something pace. I mean, his shooting's like 50, so we'll, we'll kind of gloss over that for now. But, um, you know, good dribbling, five star skills, four star weak foot. He's going to bang them. I'm telling you, I control a disconnected fuck's sake. Wee! Fuck's sake. This is no time for games. Anyway, right. Attempt number two. Um, uh, again, I don't know if I'll cut out any of that or keep it in. But that's the team. Playing with Tomori up, up top. My controller disconnected, so we're trying again. Um, yeah, it, I hate FIFA. I, I really do. Um, like if your controller disconnects, especially on PC, you reconnect it. It's like, I've forgotten what you were using. <laughs> so, come on, man. Good Lord. It's got Hierro. It's got Zidane, is it? Zidane. Mbappe, it's got Balak, Kondogbia, it's a good team, it's a good team, it's no match for, no match for Tomori. Oh, look at him go, Tomori's already in, go on, bang it son. No, oh well, I, he has got 50 shooting I suppose, so yeah, fair enough I guess. How does that go in? There's two people in front of the fucking ball, man. There's two people in front of the fucking ball. This fucking bolding spot, man. I'm sorry. Cool. Yeah, okay, fine. Whatever. 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 We tried. We tried. I just don't understand. Like, Maradona, Kaka, all these, you know, people that have... Ran at Mendy, brilliant. All these people that have got really high passing just can't pass the ball. I'd understand it if, you know, like, Tomori up at strike on three chemistry booted the ball, you know, a ways away. But it's Maradona and Kaka on ten chemistry and they can't they can't make a, a half-decent pass. It's insane. Thank you, yeah. Passing exactly to the brilliant, yeah. I love how I love how uh, the game switched to me as well from Poyol. Look at that, Maradona again, making the weird ass pass. Uh, it just it breezes past me there. Brilliant, fantastic. It's just it's just not going to the people I wanted to. Like, what am I meant to do? What am I doing? Are we seeing this? Are we even playing the same game right now? Holy shit, man. Maybe that's the, uh, the the meta is just not to pass it. Don't care. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm joking. God damn. Kaka puts us one nil up top. Uh, one nil uh, in the lead. Holy shit. Yeah, it, it's just it's laggy. It's fucking atrocious right now. Passes are weird. Yo, Tamori's on side as well. No, he's n he wasn't ref. You're a fucking stinker. He was on side. I know he was because I saw it with my eyes. Make the run. Bang. Bang. What a finish. Tamori. Do the celebration. Get in the celebration, gang. You love to see it. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Look at that, Tamori bangs one. 50 shooting, what are you saying? 45 finishing, what What are you saying? What are you saying? Yeah, no. That's what I'm saying. Bang. Go on. Bang. Goal. Balak. I mean, he's fucking tall, man. He's tall. He, he ain't got in the celebration gang. Let's go. I was a bit late to that. But he's now in the celebration gang. You love to see it. <laughs> Okay, that was that was pretty shit. That was a finesse shot as well. Finesse shot. And he started like using a bit more skills with Tamori if possible. Yeah, wait, I'm 3-1 ahead. When did that happen? So the time when I asked him to make the fucking 
Oh my god. That's going to be a goal. I don't remember. I'm getting so tilted because when I'm in defence, I'm not pressing B, but my defenders are diving in. Yet when I do press B, they don't dive in. Man, it's... Uh, this whole fucking shit is so trash. See him making that run. Go on. Balak for the winner. Bang. There you go. Never in doubt. Gone. Tomori is a god, man. Tomori is a god up front. He's not. He sucks. Um, but how many goals? Did he? I'm pretty sure he scored. He got one. So I'm I'm okay with that. One. Uh, he made the vital vital pass. I'm pretty sure at the end to uh, send Balak on through. So you know, I don't think he did too bad. To be fair, utterly dominated. Yeah, that's the number I'm gonna have to call in a minute for a fucking assistance. Jesus. <laughs> Maybe it's me. Maybe it's me. But I genuinely do feel like everybody's playing worse because Tamori is at striker. Um, maybe it's just a placebo, but fuck, it's so it's so dense. This game is. It's li it's literally got the the IQ of about a toddler. Jesus. I'm not even sure the point I was trying to make, but like I, when the game feels bad, it just it just feels bad and bad and bad just can't cope with it just cannot cope with it why? why couldn't anybody just fucking pass the ball to your boy Tomori yo got on Thomas that's a foul, ref. Come on. Blow the whistle. Do it. Oh, can Dobby moved out of the way? Absolute spanner. Good job, Kalito. compact and like you know like how compact his defense is it's amazing really is a, a joy to play against I can't, I can't believe he did that I can't believe he did that I can't believe Tomori didn't pick up the ball there as well it's just unreal man just unreal Make the run, please. Fuck's sake. Please make the run. Dogbit, please, no. I'll oh, get out. Get the fuck out of here if that ever happen. Oh my god, why is he passing it so weirdly? Fuck. It's 
too late, man. Just doesn't do it quick enough. Just will not do it quick enough. I can't get the uh, inputs to go quick enough. Some shit, man. I didn't even press X, did I? Oh, maybe I did. Fuck's sake, man. I knew it was going down the middle as well. I just knew it. Unreal. Okay, fair enough. Penalty, finally. Thank you, Jesus Christ. Hey, what are we saying? What are we saying? Tomori's, uh, Tomori's penalty. 34 penalties. Right. Bangs one. Down the middle. There you go. Tomori puts it in the back of the net. You love to see it. It might have been a penalty. But it was a well-worked penalty, to say the least. Can't believe uh, it's a great save by Czech. Can't believe he got past me there. Tomori, bang one. Oh. You're kidding. You're actually kidding. No, Tomori. All because he wouldn't fucking control the ball. <laughs> I'm sorry. This game is an actual joke. This game is a joke. Anyway, we go again. We will try again. Uh, we, we've already won one game, so it doesn't really matter at this point what happens from here on out. But, uh, okay, so probably probably the final opponent, depending on how things go in this game, uh, probably will be the final opposition today. But uh, it's got a nice team. It's got a nice team as well. Can't argue with it. Can't argue with it. At least it's a little different from seeing Mendy and Varane at the back each and every fucking time. I'm sorry, there was an indication I got the ball because the ball pings away. Oh yeah, classic, you know, classic. Changed my mind at the last second as well. Changed my mind. Brilliant. This is the one. This is the one. Tomori. Oh my god. What a finish by... Not sure. Tomori. What a finish by Tomori. I don't know why I made that more difficult for myself. Let's go. Bang. What a pass. To Tomori again. Who's going to bang one. What a finish. Tomori, you love to see it. That deserves the celebration. I'm sorry, that does deserve the celebration. It's not toxic. That was an absolute banger. 45 finishing. <laughs> Look at that 50 shooting by Tomori. Just things you do love to see. Bang, get fucking dropped. <laughs> it's going to be another goal. Watch this. Bang, Tomori. Wait. Oh, I... Oh, I didn't realise I had the ball there. That sucks. Oh, let's go. Tomori flicking out those skills. Let's go. Just P-rolls it past the goal. It wasn't a good goal. All right, I'm being very toxic right now. But look at this. The little flip-flap, whatever it's called. In and out. Move your feet. Tomori scores another one. Penalty. Let's go. Let's go. Just drawing out the foul. Just things you love to see. And you know who's going to take it. It's going to be your boy, Fikia Fikayo Tomori. Bang. Bang. Oh, my God. What an absolute banger by Kakri. He, he was like, you scored? Yeah, nah. Yeah, nah. Don't, we, don't, we, don't, we don't take that kind of trash around here. We just bang it in from outside the box and there's nothing you can do, so get gone. Tomori! He sucks, man. He just sucks. In general, just sucks. But Niketia doesn't. It wasn't bad, to be fair. It was not bad at all. <laughs> it 
if only I was just hoping that person was not going to be uh, Tomori. And uh, guess what? It was. Eddie Nketiah, let's go, gets on the score sheet. You love to see it. I'm telling you, people, people like you see Eddie Nketiah in the team, but like, oh, it's a silver. He's never going to score. Hat trick, guaranteed. Okay, what we've learned today is that Eddie Nketiah is not very good at passing the ball. Um, and Tamori is not very good as a striker, as you would imagine. Who would have thought it? Who would have thought it? But he did get a 10.0 rating, and basically the guy was pretty garbage. Um, even though he scored four, it was the four of the same thing. And I, I don't know how I didn't, you know, didn't uh, manage to stop it. But it was just that cross, bang, you know, volley into the back of the net. It, like, check, just, check is, is just shit. Um, but he got a hat-trick. Tamori got a hat-trick. I think that's pretty much mission accomplished, even though we weren't really doing anything. I think to get a hat-trick with Tamori in any single game is uh, pretty special. Eddie with, Eddie with one. And Kaka with one as well. Like, just amazing. Amazing stuff. And there you go. 5 4. Things you do love to see. Really was. Um, yeah, it was good fun. It was actually good fun playing with Tamori. I mean, it's gonna it's gonna knock up his goal tally to the highest it's ever going to be. But um, yeah, as a striker goes, he's not the one. He's not the one, Chief. He's quick and he's agile. Like, you know, against a, an opponent that may may not be so good at defending. Um you know, he, he can get past people. He really can. Really, really can. Just like an average striker. But when it comes to finishing, he's uh, it's pretty, uh, it's pretty, it's pretty poor. <laughs> it's pretty poor. But let's go look how many goals he actually scored in total. Six and five with two assists. Now, as a centre back, that's pretty damn good. That's pretty damn good. And some of the goals he scored, as you would have seen, aren't half bad. Having the skill moves definitely helps him as a striker. Um, but how he scored five when he's got 43 finishings, what he would have played with, I have no idea. And he had 55 shot power. So how, how on earth any of those shots went in the back of the net? God only knows. Okay, so to end off today's episode, we are going to be opening the brand new foot birthday party bag because I like pain. Um, we are using, as you can see, uh, David Silva. And he's, he's one that's like... Uh, I mean, let's face it, he sucks. I mean, his passing's good, his dribbling's good, but whatever, he's just terrible. Uh, the rest is just standard. The only uh, fodder we've used is just PK as an 86. Probably didn't need to, but I literally have nothing in the club right now, so um doesn't matter. But let's see what we get, you know? It, it's always a risk, isn't it? If we um, don't get anything better than what we put in, it's a bit of an L, but most likely it's going to be a, it's gonna be a bit of an L anyway. As long as it's not a headline, as we get to see it walk out, that'd be quite cool. Um, I don't really know who I don't really know who that I'd actually want out of it. Like I've always said, I, the most ideal one would be the uh, Alfonso Davies Road to the Final Team Tournament, whatever that card is. I'm not I can't remember what card th type he's got. And Alfonso Davies would be perfect. Um, but besides that, it doesn't really matter as long as it's not a dupe. Let's see what we get though. Come on, what are we saying? What are we saying? To walk out at least. Ew, ooh, is that a what if? Ooh, yo, that's not bad. Let's go. We got him Babu. Of course, we did pack him when he was out in packs. Uh, and we sold him for a good 400,000 coins. Then immediately dropped to way under 300. <laughs> so, things you do love to see. But that is an incredible pull. He might have to go in over Bellerin now, actually. That's crazy. That's a crazy, that's really good pull, actually. That's really good. Because we've got a lot of German league players that we could actually fit in with him. Yeah, well, let's, uh, let's go have a look at what the team would look like. Okay, I would, I would say it was a big dub. We gave up David Silver, who's completely useless for us anyway, for an actually really good upgrade to the team. Of course, once he's played 10, he'll probably get 8. I'm pretty sure that's how it works, isn't it? Uh, oh, no, because he's already, he's packed pulled, isn't he? So... I'd have to have a German man or a German league manager. Anyway, even on seven, that's still pretty good. You know, you'd get plus threes across the board. So, not too upset with that. I'm pretty happy with that, to be fair. I'm pretty happy with that. Um, that's a big upgrade for the team. Some of where we didn't necessarily need an upgrade, but obviously Hector Bellerin, he isn't amazing, let's face it. And also, he's really only just got his pace. But, um, I mean, if you compare them, they're not, they're not comparable. 
like Mbappé beats him for everything. 88 physical, 86 defending, 85 dribbling, which is, is moderately the same. 82 passing, which is a lot better. 60 shooting and 96 pace. That's crazy good. I'm very happy with that. Somebody we've actually got that we could use for once. That's nuts. A really, really good pull. Um, amazing. Wow. Like, oh, just amazing. Crazy. Yeah, can't believe it. That's amazing. But there we go. What a way to end this episode. What a way to end this episode. Uh, yeah, there we go. And there we go. So hopefully I've enjoyed this video. Um, yeah, what a crazy day. Obviously, had a lot of fun playing with Tomori up, up, up front. It was, it was frustratingly fun. Because it was frustrating because he, he wasn't amazing. But also it was frustrating playing against some of those people just uh ultra defensive it was difficult but you know we scored we scored some bangers to be fair scored some absolute bangers so hopefully hopefully enjoyed that and obviously the party bag at the end um incredible very very good obviously could have been better could have been like um a foot birthday or somebody you know a lot better but it's actually somebody usable that we can put straight into the team and start using straight away and it's, it's just a massive upgrade crazy you love to see it so hopefully you have enjoyed this video if you have please do drop it a like that'd be very very much appreciated if you want to see more of this content and you haven't already please do consider hitting that subscribe button and become part of the exclusive family but yeah so with that said i do hope you enjoyed thank you very much for watching and as always we'll see you next time